Hello pretty people or not so pretty because this isn't going to be such a pretty one. Um, today I am going to be showing you how to create this gory sort of burnt hand effect. Um, it's lovely isn't it? Um, yeah so I've posted this on my social media before and I actually got quite a few you know, positive comments are a lot of ills, um, which is what I was going for. But today I'll be showing you how to do it, and I hope you, um, yeah, I hope you have some fun with this because this is my first special effects tutorial. So, yeah, I hope you enjoy it, and I hope you have fun with it, and I'll see you guys soon. Okay. So the first things that you're going to need are pieces of tissue halved and then ripped up into, torn up into small squares as rough as possible. Probably only really need one full tissue. Um, I have liquid latex, this one's from Cryolan and it's amazing. Then we have um, a couple of different shades of foundation. I have... couple of different shades of eyeliner so I've got a brown and a black here I have some powder just to powder that down a bit better just to set it I have a couple of different shades of eyeshadows um, just to make some bruising and of course I have here some fake blood this is the Mayron one the coagulated blood gel so let's begin I've already primed my hand and I'm now going to grab some of those tissue pieces and my liquid latex and you want to go the liquid latex first. I don't think I want my tissue that big. Also, um, do not use this if you are allergic to to latex because it is a common allergy which sucks as you apply this you really want to blend out the edges Oh my god, this smells funky. Just make it sort of as crinkly as possible. So kind of more so stipple it rather than wipe it. So yeah, that's nice and crinkly, just how I wanted it. Okay, so here I am putting on something fairly close to my own skin tone. Doesn't matter if it's a little bit darker. I'm going to go, be going in with a much darker one. And it doesn't matter if you leave a little bit of white tissue underneath. Kind of spot that in places. And this is where the eyeliners come in. Okay, so I'm just going to be grabbing a thick brush and I'm going to be going with the brown first. Just kind of stippling that 
in random places and you don't want it too dark. You just want to make it look discoloured. You sort of want, obviously we've got, we kind of want to make a singed look. Doing the same thing with the black. And I'm just grabbing, I have another eyeliner here, and this is from Essence. I'm just going to be sort of drawing actual dots. Of course, like we said, we're just kind of just colouring things. Now I'm going in with a slight amount of powder. Which works so well because you sort of want a, that sort of dry look. Okay. Now, powder everywhere. Now I'm grabbing my eyeshadows. So I'm grabbing a red and a hint of blue. And I'm just going around the outside. But yeah, obviously a lot more blue. So this is going to make like an irritated look. To make it look like a really affected area, you're going to just go sort of up the fingers. Now I'm doing my favourite part and this is the Coagulated Blood Gel and I'm actually still using that same sponge I use for liquid latex but I'm just using the end of it. So I'm just grabbing it off the spatula thing. I'm just dabbing it on. Okay, so that was my finished... Um, burned hand tutorial um looks great doesn't it looks yeah um yeah so i had a lot of fun creating it and yeah so if you would like to see any more of these videos please let me know and i will be sure to so if you enjoyed this video Please, you know, like it, thumbs up, subscribe, 
like all that good stuff um yeah and i hope to see you guys soon bye